Introduction Tejas is out shopping with his parents at a retail store. He chooses a pair of jeans, a jacket and a sweatshirt while his father selects a coat for himself. When they present these items at the cash counter, the cashier hands them over a bill. Tejas' father goes through the bill and makes the payment. When they reach home, Tejas asks his father for the bill because he is curious to know the details listed on the bill. Let us learn how a bill is prepared. Objectives At the end of this lesson, you will be able to Perform addition on money with and without conversion Perform subtraction on money with and without conversion Prepare a bill Currency facts the Indian currency is known as the rupee. The word rupee comes from the Sanskrit word rupaya, which denoted the stamped coins used in the ancient India. This symbol associated with the Indian rupee. Indian currency is made up of coins and notes known as bank notes. While the coins are minted by the government of India, the bank notes are issued by the Reserve Bank of India, RBI. Addition by conversion. You are aware that 1 rupee is equal to 100 paise. It means 2 rupees are equal to 200 paise. 3 rupees are equal to 300 paise. 4 rupees are equal to 400 paise. And 5 rupees are equal to 500 paise. So, 1 rupee 25 paise is the same as 100 paise and 25 paise. That is, 125 paise. By the same logic, 1 rupee 50 paise is equal to 150 paise. 1 rupee 75 paise may also be represented as 175 paise and 2 rupees 75 paise is equal to 275 paise. Let us add 2 rupees 50 paise and 3 rupees 50 paise. 2 rupees 50 paise is equal to 250 paise. 3 rupees 50 paise is equal to 350 paise. So we add 250 and 350 paise, which is equal to 600 paise. We now add 4 rupees 25 paise and 5 rupees. 4 rupees 25 paise is equal to 425 paise. 5 rupees is equal to 500 paise. So we add 425 and 500, which is equal to 925 paise. Addition without conversion. We can write 25 paise as 25p. In the same way, we can write 50 paise as 50p and 75 paise as 75p. We can write 1 rupee as rupee 1 in the same way. 2 rupees can be written as rupees 2, 3 rupees can be written as rupees 3, 4 rupees as rupees 4 and so on. Now we can write 1 rupee 25 paise as rupee 1.25 p, 2 rupees 50 paise as rupees 2.50 p, 3 rupees 75 paise as rupees 3.75 p, and 10 rupees 10 paise as rupees 10.10p. Let us now perform additions without any conversions. Let's add 6 rupees 25 paise and 2 rupees 50 paise. First, write 6 rupees 25 paise as rupees 6.25p. Just below it, write 2 rupees 50 paise rupees 2.50p in such a way that the rupee part falls in the rupee column and passe part falls in the passe column. Step 1. Add the numbers in the passe column. 25 plus 50 is equal to 75. Write 75 in the passe column. Step 2. Add the numbers in the rupees column. 6 plus 2 is equal to 8. Write 8 in the rupees column. The result of the addition is 8 rupees 75 paise. Now take another example. Add 45 rupees 50 paise and 20 rupees 50 paise. Step 1. 
add the number in the passe column as 50 plus 50 which is equal to 100 passe. We know that 100 passe is equal to rupee 1. So write two zeros in the passe column and carry forward 1 to the rupee column. Step 2. Add the numbers in the rupees column. 1 plus 45 plus 20 is equal to rupees 66. Write 66 in the rupees column. So the answer is 66 rupees. Self-assessment. Drag and drop the correct option into its respective place. Subtraction by conversion. Ravina gets 9 rupees 50 passe from her mother as pocket money. She spends 5 rupees and 50 passe on toffees. What is the pocket money left with her? Let's take a look. 9 rupees 50 passe means 950 passe and 5 rupees 50 passe means 550 passe. Write 550 passe under 950 passe. Now subtract them. 0 minus 0 is equal to 0. Write 0 under 0, 0 column. 5 minus 5 is equal to 0. Write 0 under 5, 5 column. 9 minus 5 is equal to 4. Write 4 under 9, 5 column. So the amount left with Ravina is 400 paise, that is 4 rupees. Subtraction without conversion. Let's learn how to subtract 5 rupees 25 passe from 8 rupees 75 passe. Note here, write 8 rupees 75 passe as rupees 8.75 passe. Then write 5 rupees 25 passe as rupees 5.25 passe and do it in such a way that the rupee part falls in the rupee column and passe part falls in the passe column. Subtract 25 from 75 to get 50. Write 50 in the passe column. Subtract 5 from 8 to get 3. Write 3 in the rupee column so the answer is 3 rupees 50 passe. Self-assessment. Hey friends, it's time to check what you have learned. Read carefully the given statement and choose the correct option for it. Bill. Do you know what a bill is? Bill is a piece of paper which contains details of all the purchases made by you from a shop. The details include the names of the items purchased, their costs and the total. Making Bill Now we will learn how to make a bill. Ramita bought two pencils, two toffees, one ball and a book. Prepare a bill for Ramita. Make four columns. Item Rate per item, rupees and passe. Under the item column, write the names of the different items purchased. Under the rate per item column, write 2 rupees, 1 rupee 25 passe, 5 rupees and 10 rupees against pencil, toffees, ball and book. Two pencils cost 4 rupees, so write 4 in the rupees column and 0, 0 in the passe column. Two toffees cost 2 rupees 50 passe, so write 2 in the rupee column and 50 in the passe column. One ball costs 5 rupees, so write 5 in the rupees column and 0, 0 in the passe column. One book costs 10 rupees, so write 10 in the rupees column and 0, 0 in the passe column. Add numbers in the passe column. Add 0, 0 plus 50 plus 0, 0, plus 0, 0, which is equal to 50 passe. Add the numbers in the rupees column. Add 4 plus 2 plus 5 plus 10, which is equal to 21 rupees. Make a new row. Write total in this row under the rate per item column. Write 21 rupees in the rupees column. Write 50 passe in the passe column. The bill is ready. Ramita has to pay rupees 21 and 50 passe to the shopkeeper for her purchases. Summary Let us summarize what we have learned. 
addition of money with and without conversion, subtraction of money with and without conversion, and 